Hello, everyone. Welcome to Math Rover. In Year Two, Lesson Six, Chapter Two, we will introduce division of two. In this chapter, we still use kids and candies to help you understand division. As division is the reverse calculation of multiplication. The learning of division of two is based on times table of two. Let's go. First, two times two equals four. There are two kids. Each kid has two candies. So totally, there are two. Times two equals four candies. That's the meaning of two times two equals four. Reversely, we have four candies. We have four candies. We want to distribute these four candies between two kids. Evenly, we want to distribute these four candies between two kids evenly. Each kid will get two candies. That's four divided by two equals two. Four candies distribute between two kids evenly. Each kid will get two candies. That's four divided by two equals two. Next one. Two times three equals six. There are two possibilities. First possibility. There are two kids. Two kids. Each kid has three candies. So totally, there are two times three equals six candies. Another possibility: there are three kids. Each kid has two candies. Totally, there are still two times three equals six candies. All right. Reversely, we have six candies. We have six candies. If we want to distribute these six candies between two kids. Each kid will get three candies. That's six divided by two equals three. Six candies distribute between two kids evenly. Each kid gets three candies. Or still, we have six candies. But this time, we want to distribute these six candies among three kids. Of course, evenly. Each kid gets two candies. That's six divided by three equals two. Six candies distribute among three kids evenly. Each kid gets two candies. Six divided by three equals two. You 
you're welcome to have a try. Try to use kits and candies and then explain two times eight equals sixteen. Reversely, sixteen divided by two equals right eight or sixteen divided by eight equals two. Please have a try. Now I would like to explain two times nine equals eighteen together with you. So as always, two possibilities. First possibility, there are two kids. Each kid has nine candies. Nine candies, nine candies. So totally, there are two times nine equals 18 candies. Another possibility is there are nine kids. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine kids. Each kid has two candies. Two candies, two candies, two candies, two candies, two, 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 two candies. So totally, there are still two times nine equals 18 candies. All right, so reversely, we have 18 candies. 18 candies. If we want to distribute them between two kids, each kid gets nine candies. Each kid gets nine candies. That's 18 divided by two equals nine. Or still we have 18 candies. 18 candies. This time we want to distribute these 18 candies among nine kids. Six, seven, eight, nine. We want to distribute 18 candies among nine kids. As always, evenly. Now, each kid gets two candies. That's 18 divided by nine equals two. All right, that's everything for division of two. I would like to share with you. Thank you for watching. I will see you in chapter three. We will then talk about division of three. See you.